Hi everyone, in this uh, quick demo, I'm going to show you how to install Laravel Tabler and uh, Tabler Kit uh, for this new to these packages. Uh, Laravel Tabler is a dashboard template for Laravel and uh, Tabler Kit adds additional UI components to enhance uh, your projects. Uh, currently, I'm using WSL2 in this subsystem for Linux and uh, DDEB as my development environment so let's get started uh, we will start uh, by installing laravel uh, using composer uh, then we will move on to installing laravel tabler uh, using the composer command i will explain uh, each step as we go so you can easily follow along uh, next uh, we will install the tabler kit uh, which involve a few more steps uh, including setting up some uh, additional dependencies uh, if you have any questions or uh, need further assistance feel free to leave a comment below let's dive in Laravel installation is done. So let's start our DD uh, server. Yeah, uh, our server is up, so let's check the server status. Oh, I forgot to run the composer command, so let's start. Yeah, I have to in the PC version from DDEV, so here is the project and the DDEV configuration file, so I just make it PSP 8.2, start, start to do that. Uh, DDEB is restarted, so let's try one more time. I think it works, yeah. Let's see, does it work? Uh, no. Yeah, it's up and running. So now we are uh, going to install the tabular package. Let's go to the tabular docs and the installation section. Run this command. It's 
done about this one. Sorry. And now this way, yeah, it's done now. So let's randomize it. Yeah, it's done and finally export the art it's also done and that is running so, yeah it's running i think it start Start the GDP server. Let's try one more time. Yeah, I think it should work now. Yeah, it works. So let's make our Fast user is done. Now uh, install the tabular kit. Here is the tabular kit recommendation. I uh, will get it uh, in the tabular docs pages. So, this is the installation command. Yeah, so I'm using uh, DDAB as my uh, development environment. That's why I have to put the DDAB uh, first uh, to execute the command in the uh, DDAB Docker images. It's done. I'll take the next command. So, let's start it. It's done. Let's start the server. Second yeah, running. So let's try to test the tablet components. It's the root, the home pages. I don't know. it should be here. Yeah. It's working. So let's try the sign out button. Let's try the sign out component. Yeah, it should work. Yeah, it's working. <laughs> uh, I'm logged out now. So let's log in. Oh, 
let's try another let's try the ribbon one yeah <laughs> so done. so let's try the ribbon one this one and just get this yeah it's working let's try another component and uh, let's try the date picker one uh, this is the flag picker which is uh, in the advance so this is the flag picker yeah it's working and then the file uploader let's try the file uploader so file uploader one yeah it's the file uploader let's try to image file yeah it's working and uh, also available for image editing uh, if you click the uh, pen icon that uh, will enable your image manipulation feature if i copy it like this I click the save button i can save it will only upload the crop images so that's it thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe to my channel thank you